Okay, using this, that, and these and those. Wait a minute. First of all, this and that for singular. They are called demonstrative uh, adjectives, okay? But first of all, when will I use uh, this? I use it with singular. That was singular also. These was plural. Those was plural. Let's return back to this and that. This for when you are point to something which is very near or near to you. This is Basil. It means that Basil he is just two step far, uh, two steps far of me. But that is Mahmoud. It means that Mahmoud at the end of the class he is very far of me. So this uh, is for singular, which is close to me. That is for singular, uh, male or female, which is far of me. And here, these is for plural, but those group of people or group of things or group of stuffs are close to me. Those modifies plural nouns, but which is far of you, not close to you. So let me give you examples. This is Basil. It means that Basil is next to me. That is Hamoud. Hamoud, it means Hamoud. Hamoud? Yes, mister. Yeah, can you explain this and that by your own uh, style? I think you can do it. Yeah, I can. The adjectives this, that, uh, these, and those are called demonstrative <clears throat> adjectives. They point out which one of which ones, this and that modify singular nouns. No, 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 don't read. I need you to just explain it by your own style. Oh. Yeah, just tell me uh, and give me some examples to show you or show the us. Examples on the screen or uh, from my mind. This river is teeming with fish, but that one over the hill is not. Okay. These these animals look like those animals we saw by the road yesterday. No, this here river runs fast. That there river is slow and quiet. Yes. This river runs fast. That river uh, is slow and quiet. The first one that says no is the wrong one, and the second one is the correct one. Okay. Uh, can you explain, uh, Mahmoud, for it? No. Okay. Can you explain, Muaz? It's very easy and simple. Uh, I explain this, that, these, those. Yeah, these and those, this and that. Very easy. Okay, I will try. This, uh, this river is teeming. Let, let me uh, ask you some questions, and according to my questions, you can uh, uh, ask and answer. Okay. This, for, this and that. For singular nouns or for modifies plural nouns. They are uh, singular. Yes, for singular. And these and those? Uh, they are plural. Okay, you can continue. This the river is teeming with fish, but that one over the hill is not. This and that, uh, okay, they are singular, but this is pointing uh... yes go on go on go on 
I can't, Mister. It's hard a little. It's very easy. Again, again, boys. This, this, and that. Four singular nouns. This for a close singular noun. Something which is close to you, very near to you, Muaz, and Marawan. That is Marawan. It means that Marawan, he is standing very far away of me. That is Muaz, who is very far. But this is Muhammad Tariq, which is sitting next to me. Is it clear, Muaz? Muaz. Yes, Mr. Uh, Mr. Is it's it clear? clear? Something which is close to you, I'm going to use this. Something which is very far of you, I'm going to use that. And so on. Okay? So. Uh, these and those for plural. Okay, these and those for plural nouns. But these four stuffs or things or people who are near to me, very near to me. Those four things, stuffs, people who are very far to me. I think it's very, very easy. Subhi, can you explain it again, boy? What? Subhi, can you explain it again? Mr. Can I explain? Please. Okay, no problem. You can explain. Okay, this is for singular and for somebody who's close by you. Like, for example, this dude is my brother, for example. But, I, but that, we use it when we talk about something or someone that is, who is far away. Okay, great. Yeah, and that's a very fun for an example. The same thing about this and those. Those like the, the plural of that and this like the plural of this. This guy, these guys took, took my pencil. This guy took took my pencil. I gotta, I gotta mess those, get those dudes. Like that. It's, that's great. Okay. Uh, and now let's read. The adjective this, that, and these, and those are called demonstrative adjectives. They point out which or one or which ones. This and that modifies singular nouns. These and those modifies plural nouns. Let me just... Okay. Okay, this and these refer to things that are close by, something which is close to you. And that and those refers to something which is far further away, because they are far away from you. Okay. The river is is teeming with fish this river but that one over the hell is not these animals look like those animals we saw by the road yesterday so these animals they are close to you those animals they are far away of you i think now everything is clear but here he gives you a hint to be used. What is his hint? Do not use here or there after this or that or these or those. Look at here. 
this here rather no 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 it doesn't work this rather runs fast that rather is a slow and quiet so do not use here or there okay we're not going to use here or there they are not going to be used okay but we are going to start directly using this rather okay this rather that rather also he he gives you <coughs> i'm sorry don't use them in a place of these or those we are not going to use them them animals no 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 those animals okay who is uh, mahmoud Fouad, can you re-explain this and these those and uh, and that and so on boy yes mister here go i don't know how to explain it no no just to try to tell you what did you understand from it i understand it that that this that these and those are called demonstrative adjectives yeah how can i use them This and that modify singular nouns. These and those modify plural nouns. Okay, that's great. Nice. This and these refer to things that are close by. That and those refer to things farther away. Okay, great. That's great. Okay, uh, Marwan, where is Marwan? Here, mister. Okay. Can you re-explain this and that and these and those? I did not explain it, but I can give examples. Okay, with a kind of explanation, please. Okay, we can say that that and these, um, we can put it like if, if I am far from, like you're standing in front of me, and I am far from five meters. You will look to, to, to the friend that's beside and say, that is Marwan, he's, he's in front of us. You say about something that you can see. These, you're talking like there is some balls on the ground. And you're saying, these are the, uh, these are for grade six, these are the grade six balls. Maybe we can say, uh, this, this, Player is not faster than this player. Done. Okay, great. Nice. Okay. Uh, where is um, Muhammad Tariq? Muhammad. Yes, Mister. Can you re-explain it, Muhammad Tariq? Um, just in a few okay. minutes, and just only one or two minutes only, no more. Okay. These and that represents uh, singular nouns. And these and those modify polars. And if you want to uh, say something close by, you will say this and these, or these. And if you want to refer thing things uh, far away, you say uh, that or those. Great, great, great. Okay. Anything more? And now, who wants to re-explain from the other students? Just to re-explain this and these and those and that and so on. Who wants to explain? I'm waiting for students. Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah, who wants? Mr. Can I say? Okay, go on. Th this and that and and these and those are demonstrative 
adjective. This and that is is you we use it in singular and this and those in plural. If you want to say something near, you will you will you will say this, this or this. Oh, and if you want to say something far away, you would say that or those. Okay, that's great. That's very great. Okay. Uh, Yusuf Mahmoud, can you do your... Uh, uh, can you do some effort to explain this again? What? Yusuf Mahmoud, are you here? Yes. Okay, again, explain uh, that the function of this and that, these and those. What is the um, function of them? How can I use them? You know. Uh, use them and you can use them in sentences and uh, use these words uh, to make to make the sentence uh, mo make more sense. Okay, uh, so that's great. That's great. That's great. Okay, let's start, boys. Go down here. Underline the words in between practice that complete the sentence. Let's start with uh, who is in Nasser? Nasser. Nasser? So it's not Nasser. Mr. Sumuna. No. Who is he? Yes, Mr. I think this is Nasser. Let me remove him. This is not uh, one of the students. Uh, Mr. I'm here, here. Yeah, where are you, Nasser? Mr. Listen to me. Nasser, can you read number one, please? No problem. Five graces and wole trays grow beside this or this or this following river. Mr. This. Uh, this yeah, this because a flowing river is. Singular, excellent. Not these. Okay, so pay number two. Please go on, so pay. Okay, so no, no. These, sir, these. No, no, read the complete sentence, please. Okay. Um, bushes and head, hedges. Guard. The again, again, bushes and hedges guard uh, uh, the foothills of the great mountain. Mister? Yes? Number uh, three, there is a problem. Number two, that bushes, bushes or these bushes? These. These, sir, these. Yes, okay, nice. Mr. Excellent. Okay, Mr. Number three. And, uh, okay, who can answer number three? Me, Mr. Okay, go on, Muhammad. A family of glass rests in the that or that there patch of towering elephant's glass. Okay, that. Why we don't choose that there? Because we have studied here that we are not going to study to use here or there after this or that. Or these or those. There's so these. that only. The master is there. The answer. Sorry? Is the answer there? Yeah, Marwan, I think. Are you? Aren't you? Yes. I see okay, Marwan, with pleasure. Number four, go on. The clouds remembered those peaceful times when they were part when they were a part of us. It is those. Okay, yeah, times are plural, so we have to choose those. Okay, uh, who can move to number five? 
Vessel. Vessel. Number five. That or these or that dense dungeons are filled with huge trees and creeping vines. This. Okay. Um, yeah, jungles are plural, so we are going to choose Z, okay? Yep. And number six, who can do it? Mr. Kane again? Yes, go, Rakan. Who is Rakan? Um, Mr. Asad again. No, no, so Ali. Ali, where is Ali? Yes, Mr. Go on number six, Ali. Okay, Mr. Go on number six. The sun will take this river up to the sky. Okay. This. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, this river only. This, okay, this number seven, you seen? Yes, yes, Mr. I'm here. Okay, say it. Number you seven, will, please. Read it and choose the correct answer. You will go with me uh, to, me. to that village uh, near the that foot of the uh, great mountain. Uh, that yeah that because village is singular so we're going to choose that okay great greater than great okay number eight who can do it can i do it mr can i okay Khedr, go on these chimpanzees follow those gorillas into the jungle. raise your voice Khedr, i can hear you these chimpanzees follow those gorillas into the jungle mm -hmm. This and this and those. Uh, which one? The first. Yeah, this the and those. Chimpanzees. These chimpanzees and, and those. those. Okay, great. Number nine. Okay, Marwan, go on. This river and these animals are a part of a great African myth. Yeah. The, great. This and these. This and these. Yes. Yeah, this river and these animals. Okay. And uh, the last one, who can answer it? It's this. You must Um, Muhammad, Ryan, Ryan, I think Ryan, it's the turn of Ryan. Ryan didn't yes, answer. Okay. You'll go on number 10. Leopard is not the first. This. This leopard is no, not no, as complete. fast. Read the complete sentence, please. Okay. Leopard is not as fast as cheetahs. This leopard is not uh, as fast as those cheetahs. First one is this, and the second one is uh, those. Okay, so this lever and those cheetahs. Okay, that's it, boys. Uh, let me have a look about what we missed because of yesterday and the day before yesterday. Cause and effect, I think we were on Monday together, I think. Uh, no, we were there in the adjective and entropy. So, uh, inshallah, we, uh, tomorrow we are going to revise cause and effect and the vocabulary and even if we have a time we are going to revise compound words okay boys hello how is okay um, mr why do yes, you yes take yes every time like you take it so sorry? much often sorry why do we take uh cause and effect much often like, yeah, I, uh, because it's already mentioned at the book. Okay, we are going to focus on the vocabulary. Yes. Okay? And compound words. Compound words, they are like a spelling words. 
and vocabulary. So we can spend much time tomorrow, inshallah, on just focusing about them. But cause and effect, I think all of you already have, a, uh, you know, we have already studied it many times. So we can just skip it and just focus on vocabulary and compound words. Uh, do you have boys? Do you have any kind of questions? I don't. Oh, no, Mister, but you can you go back? I didn't finish the last. One. You haven't. You haven't uh, checked. This. Um, is it okay now, Ali? Yes, Mister. Thank mm -hmm. you. Oh, pleasure, boy. Mister, did we finish? Mister, yeah, should we leave right now or we stay? We finish. We can go. No, 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 don't worry. You can leave. Okay, bye. Finish, Mr. Bye. Bye. Enjoy your day. I finish. Thank you. Allah, bye. Bye. Thank you. Have a nice day. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye, Mr. Bye.